Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Fishing with Norby. Out here on the lake today, Lake Gunnersville, I got Bob Shuley with me. How you doing? I'm doing great. Awesome, and then we got Scout with us. We're gonna be trying to target some big old pre-spawn bass. It's uh, the end of February, late February here. Bassmaster Classic's coming up the first week of March, so uh, it's gonna be interesting to see what, how those guys do, but I'm gonna be out here trying to find, figure out the bass today. Um, also in this video, I'm gonna be giving away Mystery Tackle Box at the end, so stay tuned. I'll show you what's in it, tell you how to win, but I'm excited. We're gonna start fishing here, see if we can't find some bass. We're fishing all new water today. They've been pulling 200,000 gallons, which is 10 times the amount they normally do this time of year. So it might be a little tough, but I'm excited. Let's get after them. There's one. Oh shoot. I think I got hit. You going? There you go. Nice. Or let's stay right here. <laughs> That's so random. It is crazy. <laughs> yeah, on the trap. Good one. Yeah, he wanted it. He wanted it. Nice. There you go. You're schooling me today. Pardon me? I said you're schooling me today. <laughs> Look at a cast today. <laughs> You hit again? You got him? Nice. <laughs> there you go. They are not hitting the jerk bait. You came back and got it. Yeah, I saw that. He jacked it the first time. Like, I'm like, I can't believe you didn't get that. <laughs> There you go. Couple two pounders. There's one. Smoke the jerk bait. We found a little pot of them now, Bob. There we go. Smoked it. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, we found a few of them. <laughs> Scout, I bumped you. <laughs> you okay? Oh my goodness sakes. About time we found a few. There we go, guys. Nice little two and a half. Check that out. Throwing the jerk bait. Bob just caught two. He's up on me today, but that's a decent one right there. There we go. Let's get another one. Found a little pot of them, kind of behind the boat. I was like, they have to hit the jerk bait. Come on now. Did you get hit that cast? That should definitely be the ticket. Yeah. Did you hit again? Really? This is getting crazy. You got another one? You don't get it the first time. Oh my gosh. But then they come back. 
That's so cool. That's so cool. He got hit, he missed it, and he came right back, huh? Loaded up back in this pocket. Yeah, he is. They're just charging it, huh? There you go. That's a fatty. <laughs> nice. That's a good one. Super fat. Yeah, that's a chunk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard the first time. That's crazy. And they don't have it. <laughs> I don't know how they. I just hesitate and then they just kill it. Wow. It's crazy. I don't know how they don't get it the first no. time. <laughs> They're not hitting the jerk either. Well, I'm going to try the swim bait again. I'll throw something different than you. And we'll see if they eat it better or something. They're just tapping the trap. They are hitting. Big scout. You think the, the swim bait's gonna be the ticket? Now they're gone. Huh? No, I said now they're gone. We got four of them though, that's pretty good. We got us another fisherman in here now. There's one, hooked up. Another one. Yep, the jerk bait. Yeah, yeah, the bigger ones are hitting the jerk bait. Check that one out. Decent little guy. There you go. Another one. I'll chuck it around a bit. I'll chuck it around a bit. Yeah, that'd be awesome. <laughs> there you go. Awesome, you guys. With another one. With another one. I grabbed this rig. Just trying out the rig. No bites on it yet. Nice. There you go. Another one. That'll work. That'll work. It's crazy. How many fish have we caught in this school? Six or seven. Probably, yeah, six or seven bass. Roaming. They're roaming on this cloudy day, and they're just kind of out in this pocket today. And we're catching them. They're crushing the trap, guys. Bob's hooked up again. I've been throwing this Alabama rig all over there, so I'm putting this guy in. <laughs> Crushing the trap. Got a good one? Yeah. That's not a bad one. There you go. I'm going to set this back here where you had it. Yeah, that's a decent one. Nice. That one might go three He's so fat. Yeah, that's fat sucker. Good job. Thank you, sir. Yeah. There you go. I know you got both trebles in him. Plus, you got it. You've been a great guy today so far. <laughs> Putting you on him. He's showing me what lure to use. You guys know I don't like throwing the trap, but I'm about to. <laughs> Good one. Good one, Bob. Thank you. <laughs> Good one.
I just got smoked. Trap. He missed it. I dropped it after I set the hook, but he didn't come back. He didn't come back yet. He didn't come back. Oh, he got me wrapped. I hate to say it, but we got about five minutes before I gotta leave. Hope you guys enjoyed today's outing with Bob. We ran into a good little school of them, had a blast, caught like six or seven, maybe eight in that spot. And we also had like four or five more bites where we missed them. Um, so now we're gonna get to the mystery tackle box giveaway. But first, I wanna just share with you guys a little Sunday message um, from what I've, what I've been reading uh, out of the Bible in the mornings. It's from Second Chronicles, and I've read like 20 chapters uh, this month or so, and it's all about these kings and how they're following the Lord. It starts with Solomon, and it just keeps on going. But each king that's walking with the Lord, heeding God's counsel, the Lord paves the way for him each and every time. He, he goes into battle or an enemy will rise against him and that king will seek the Lord and the Lord will pave the way. Something always happens. So the, the Lord always does something to the enemy uh, and they have victory over the enemy. And every king that does not follow the Lord, that starts worshiping idols, other gods, they end up getting the Lord's wrath and they lose to the enemy every time. So I wanna encourage you guys, whatever you're going through, don't run away from the Lord, run to the Lord and he'll get you through it. But all right, let's open up this mystery tackle box and we're gonna give it away one week from today. So all you have to do to enter to win this giveaway, drop me a comment down below, hit that thumbs up button for me on this video and make sure you're subscribed to my YouTube channel. Let's see what they got. Oh, they got a new Guggen Squad jerk bait. All right, some Bass Dynasty little craws. Okay, they got some little green pumpkin beavers. All right, ah, oh, they got some cool looking swim baits. Check those out. They're it's like a variety pack. They got different colors in there. They got a cool little Yozuri spinner bait. It's actually not a spinner bait. It's called the knuckle bait. What it is, it's got a ball for a blade instead of a blade. That's interesting, I've never tried that. Have you guys ever tried a spinnerbait with a ball? Let me know. And then we got some drop shot weights. You guys know I throw a drop shot when the fishing gets tough. And then there's some little drop shot hair, hair jigs. So you could probably add those to your line and pick up a few bites here when you're fishing. So that's what's in this week's mystery tackle box. I'll be giving that away one week from today in another YouTube video. So stay tuned. God bless you guys. And remember, pick up some Cast Your Cares on the Lord, Fishing with Norby Apparel. You can support me on Patreon and uh, support my YouTube channel. What God's doing is pretty awesome, but I can't thank you all enough for watching this video. You guys, seriously, your, all your comments, everything you guys do for me, uh, just to show me support, I can't thank you enough. I really appreciate it, and it keeps me going. It keeps me going, keeps me encouraged, uh, but I'm gonna keep going no matter what. So I hope you enjoyed the video. We'll catch you next time here on Fishing with Norby.